What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Guys, today I wanted to do something a tad bit different, right? I want all my candidates out there to know that this job that they are trying out to do isn't all just guns and rainbows, all right? You don't just go out on mission and shoot people in the face. Guys, the harsh reality is when you shoot, those people shoot back, all right? I had a couple of candidates reach out to me wanting to know um, exactly how to deal with the death of a teammate or just falling brothers in arms, all right? For starters, guys, I need you guys to understand that death comes for all of us, all right? In combat, you keep it light until it's time to get dark and then you get pitch black, all right? This is what I mean by that. When you lose a falling brother in combat, you need to maintain your composure. You need to maintain your personality, right? You need to keep being that person that you are, not for you, but for the sake of your brothers to your left and right, all right? So you keep it light. And then the next time you guys go out, you turn off the lights and you get pitch black and avenge your falling brothers, all right? That's how you deal with a falling brother in combat, guys. You don't let it overwhelm you, right? You don't let it change you, right? But you keep that in the back of your mind for the next mission. And then you go out there and you do work. Here's a few other things, guys, that you can do to help you deal with a falling brother, all right? For starters, guys, you need to talk about it, all right? You need to talk to your teammates. You need to talk to your wives. You need to talk to your friend about your falling brother, all right? Another thing you can do, guys, is you gotta live for your friend, okay? But I encourage you to celebrate life and live for your friend, okay? Last thing you can do, guys, is you can do charity events, right? And you can do several other events to remember your friend by, all right? So you can celebrate them and what they used to be by going to these events and by you know, putting on events in their names, all right? I know this one was a sensitive one, but when you're looking at doing something, guys, you need to make sure you have all the facts, all right? You need to know exactly what you're going into, all right? That just makes you better at your job, all right? Because to be honest with you guys, once I stopped being fearful of death, that's when I became the best warrior I could be, all right? Knowing that death comes for all of us and that it could come at any time, like that made me fearless on the battlefield, guys. I hope this information was helpful, all right? If you have any questions for me, leave them in the comments below and I'll get to them as soon as possible. I appreciate you guys watching. You have a good one.